hey guys and welcome back to my channel so as you guys can see my hair is still stretched out from that ponytail hairstyle that i had in but it is also extremely dry like well it feels dry to me it has a lot of product in it like a lot of um edge control and things like that in it so what i'm going to do in today's video is really just give my hair some real deal TLC because it's really in need and it's just long overdue so so in today's video I'm pretty much doing a rice water clay mask in my hair so my hair is really just going through it right now so I'm really trying to add a few things in my hair just to kind of give it a little bit more nourishment just to kind of help it out a little bit and y'all honestly I put a lot of heat on my hair when I straightened it out and did that ponytail so I'm hoping this helps my curls revert back a lot of people use this on their hair for, well, they use the the, the clay mask on their hair for um, damaged hair or if they're trying to get their curls just to come back to life a little bit. And as you guys know, if you watch my channel, I do have a texturizer, so my curls definitely are not completely natural, but I'm trying to just, you know, give them a little bit more of a push, a little bit more of a boost because to me, it seems like my ends are just really frizzy. So hopefully this helps with that. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is just start applying it to my hair. Um, this is what, oh, let me also do a length check before we even get started. I'm not sure how frequently I'm going to do this, but I'm just going to go ahead and give you guys a length check for my hair. Let me put this down real quick. So this is the front of my hair. It comes to about right here. That's the front. So I'm gonna do the side real quick. This is where the side comes down to. So we are pretty much right a little bit past the top of the B on this shirt. Now let's do the back. So y'all, I have a lot of breakage in the back of my hair. I'm not sure why that is, but it's a ton, a ton, a ton of breakage. So the back is actually the shortest part of my hair. I'm gonna go ahead and measure that out as well. And that comes down to about right there. Oh, sorry, about right there. So that's how long my hair currently is, but it is going through it right now. It's a little bit damaged. So we're trying to, you know, just rejuvenate it and get it back flowing, you know? Oh. Before we even get any further into this video, if you have not already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Welcome to my channel if it's your first time hearing about me or finding me. Welcome, welcome. Hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell as well so you're alerted when I post new videos. Thank you guys. I want to say thank you for watching. If this video is helpful, give it a thumbs up and let's go ahead and get started. Let's go ahead and apply this mask and see what it does for my hair.
all right you guys so this is what my hair looks like with the clay installed and in, not installed what am i talking about with the clay um put into my hair this is like the rice water clay like i said well i didn't really give you guys much of an in-depth description of what i did so i pretty much just took my rice water mixture and instead of adding regular water i added rice water which has the peppermint oil lavender oil castor oil things like that in the water as well and then i added a little bit of apple cider vinegar just to cleanse my scalp some as well so that's pretty much it and i did the clay and the rice water and so far I think I am noticing some curl pattern on this side. This side's a little limp. I don't know if I added more heat to this side or what. Or we'll, or we'll see when my hair is, um, when I rinse this side of my hair. But I do see some type of curl definition. So hopefully when I rinse it out, it's still like defined. So yeah, this is what it looks like. I'm going to give you guys a full 360 spin and then we're going to go ahead and wrap it up. I'm going to let it dry all the way and then I'm going to rinse it out. So once I rinse it out, I'll come back to you guys and show you guys what my curl pattern and everything looks like. And just tell you guys what I noticed about my hair. All right, you guys, so I just finished washing it out my hair. I let it sit for about 45 minutes. So I actually let it sit for about an hour. And when I finally rinsed it out, my hair was, well, not my hair, the clay was actually almost completely dry except for a little bit at my roots. That was still wet a little bit. Yeah. But you guys, this stuff really made a difference in my hair. Like, as you'll see in the video, overall, it made my hair feel so much stronger and thicker than it was before. Before, it felt kind of brittle. But, yeah, I just wanted to go ahead and let you guys know that. And also, for the people who are easily triggered, I am so sorry. I didn't notice the clay until um, after I stopped filming and recording. But don't worry, I got it off. I'm just sorry that it was there during the whole video. And I washed it out. Hold on, let me shake it out. And this is what my hair looks like. Honestly, I think it has a little bit more definition. Like, oh, wow, it does. Okay, yeah, this part's texturized. So, yeah, we know it's a little looser than the top. We get it, we get it. But... So this is what my hair looks like. Let me go ahead and try to give y'all a closer shot. So this is what my hair looks like. So my hair definitely does feel softer and I do notice that it is more defined. So what I'm probably going to do now is first I'm going to go ahead and rinse my hair again because I can already see a few spots where I kind of missed like right up in this area and it was a few spots in the back. Well I will go ahead and rinse that out and then I'm going to put some moisturizer on my hair and just put my hair in like probably four braids just to keep it stretched out and that's probably all I'm going to do with my hair for tonight just keep it soft and moisturized y'all i'm trying to really get my hair back to a healthier state like i don't know i haven't really dealt with my hair in a while so i'm getting to know it all over again it's what it feels like honestly so i'm about to go ahead and do that with my hair and then but i do notice like that that mask is very it has like zero slip it's very like rough when you put it in your hair, it makes your hair almost feel kind of brittle. But I can already notice that, like, it's just, I don't know, but it also makes it feel moisturized. Like, it just feels more, I don't know, like, more durable. I don't know. It makes my hair feel just softer and just kind of stronger as well. But I wonder if that has to do with the rice water also. 
but so far I'm loving the results I'm probably gonna see how often can you do this mask because I want to kind of do it once a week or twice a week at the beginning of the week and in the middle I don't know let me know if you guys have found let me know if you found this video helpful let me know if your hair texture is similar to mine and you are watching because you're like hmm does this work does it not work let me know so that is pretty much it for this video like comment subscribe if you have not already hit the notification bell if you have not already thank you guys so much for watching my channel i will see you guys next time in my next video so goodbye hey guys so i'm trying something new out with my content so if you made it to the end of this video you are definitely a trooper and i thank you guys so much so so much for your comments and your support like comment subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you guys next time in my next video uh, seems like breathing ain't enough to keep me free.